set eyes on you uh, back in May of 2010. I turned to my right and told my best man, Kevin, that uh, that's the kind of girl I can see myself with. Who would have known that eight months later, uh, we would actually meet, and me offering you a cookie would be the start of where we are today. When I started putting these thoughts to paper, I had a picture of you on my desk to look at. I do this because when I see your face, my mind, body, and soul truly feel pure, happy, and creative. And that's when I get the best results. Since you have been in my life, I have learned so much more about morals, trust, communication, kindness, and knowing when to be a little stern. I know for a fact I can't live without you. And as far as I'm concerned, there is no better balance of two individuals than us. For the rest of our very, very long and healthy lives together, I promise to always be there for you, right or wrong, to never give up on us, no matter what, and to always communicate and listen to you at all times. I promise to stay positive in any circumstance and to love you more and more every day for the rest of our lives. I promise to say I love you every day, kiss you every day, and hold you every day for at least 10 seconds. <laughs> to provide for our family, and no matter what, always find a way. I promise to be the best husband, father, supporter, and anything else you need me to be at any time. Get close. I promise to keep our relationship fun, exciting, and spontaneous in many ways. Can I put a little wink on here? I promise to excuse myself at least 90% of the time. It's another wink. And I promise that even though I have to prove myself right three times for you to believe me, I will never doubt your trust in me. Kathleen, Janice, Enzel, soon to be Thomas, you are my best friend, my love, the mother of my son, with more to come, and an amazing, amazing individual that I am lucky and thankful to have as a part of my life and honored to call my wife. Thank you for saying yes, and I love you, infinity times infinity. <laughs> My whole life, I never saw myself getting married. I could never envision it. Then two and a half years ago, while I was working, I met you and you stole me heart. From the time you asked me, do you want a cookie? <laughs> and said you made them. When I knew you didn't, but I went along with it anyway. To our first date downtown Seattle, and you held me while I was walking around because I was in stiletto heels and it was raining. And slippery. To the day you proposed, I didn't want to get out of bed because I was so tired and you were nervous slash excited and in the best mood and I was so not. To right now as I stand in front of you, pledging my vows with all of our friends and family to witness. Chester, you make me the happiest person in the world. And I promise to try and do the same for you every day. I promise to take care of you and our family to the best of my ability, through sickness and in health and every other day in between. I promise to encourage, inspire, and support you through good times and bad, through sorrow and success, and to be there to laugh with you and lift you up when you're down. I promise to always be faithful to you, have patience, keep open communication, and be your listening ears and open arms whenever you need me. I promise to, I promise to embrace our similarities and our differences and start our own family traditions and new spontaneous adventures. I promise to always work at our love and always make you a priority in my life. But most, imp most importantly, I promise to honor, respect, cherish, and love you for every second of our lives until death do us part. Chester Thomas III, you are my best friend, my better half, my soulmate, my one true love. I thank God every day he brought us together and it's such a perfect time. I could never envision my life any other way, and I look forward to our future together as well. I love you.